Hey all, welcome or welcome back to my channel. This is Anita. So in today's video, we're going to see a dot painting uh, tutorial. So uh, for those who don't have the dot painting tools, don't worry. We are going to do this painting with the painting brush, normal synthetic painting brush. And this dot painting is going to be a little bit intricate and simple and easy for you all. So without further ado, let's quickly get into the video. So for this project I have taken a black uh, chart paper and painted on top of it with the black paint to get the sheen look and then we'll need a compass scale pencil eraser to prepare the base and uh, the brushes uh, I'm, I've taken a few small size synthetic brushes and a uh, few large size brushes and then a dotting tool for small dots Coming to the paint, I have taken uh, 6 acrylic colors, 2 in blue shade, 2 in plum shade and 2 in uh, pink shade. The chart paper which I have taken uh, measures to 13.5 uh, cm. So as usual, I am preparing the base sheet uh, which we used to do for mandala. If you have not seen the video, I will link it in the description box how to prepare the base sheet for mandala. So as I said earlier, today's video is going to be a little bit intricate. I have planned to do the center part a little bit intricate. So I have taken bright blue color uh, to dot in the center. So in this whole video, we are going to do it with the brush and uh, the small dots with the dotting tool. I personally like to do dot painting with paint brush because after drying, it will give the embossed effect as you can see here. After it started dotting, I got the idea of adding little bit sparkles to the painting. So I added a pearl white color um, as a lace on top of the violet dots.
So that's going to be the first circle or first round of the dot painting. So for this slightly bigger dots, I have taken triple zero synthetic brush. So as you can see, I'm going back and forth to add paint on top of the dots. Only by adding the paint, you'll get this embossed effect. So once again, I'm adding the paint on top of the dots. That's going to be the third layer of paint. So after done with that, I'm going back to the pearl white color to add the string lace kind of effect in between the gaps. So that's going to be the center part of this uh, painting. Uh, so that's all with the intricate design. Uh, now we're going to dot free-handed or uh, large size dots to make a border kind of effect for this small mandala. So that's going to be the border or another row of this mandala painting. Now it's like a play time. I'm going to add random dots all over the empty areas with blue and purple color. This dots can be of any size. We're just going to uh, fill the empty areas in the corner with the blue and the purple color to just make this pink color stand out.
so i feel the corners are a little bit plain so i'm adding the white pearl color um tiny dots on top of this blue color just like uh, stars in the sky So that's going to be the final look of this painting. You can later erase the pencil marks with eraser. So hope you all enjoyed this video. If you do like this video and thanks for watching till this point. We'll meet in the next video. Until then, bye.